Okay, so in this question, a car traveling at a constant velocity covers a distance of 100 meter in 5 seconds. Velocity is constant. The thrust of the engine is 1.5 kN. What is the power of the car? Generally, in these kind of questions, like there is a thrust that is created by the engine and then there is a friction. So you have to find the F net and there are so many things. But this question, uh, it has been simplified for us by just one given statement that the car is moving with a constant velocity. If it was having uh, something else, like the velocity is not constant, at that time, the things will become really cumbersome. But now, because it is given that the car is moving at constant velocity, it has been really simplified now. So we know that the power is given by F into V in such a case, when velocity is constant. You see, ironically, the body is being acted upon by a force, but still it is moving with a constant speed. It is moving with constant velocity. It is not getting accelerated despite of having a force. Now that is the most important thing. This is quite confusing for many students. So don't worry. So if it is given in the question itself that the velocity is constant, we can apply this formula uh, without any doubt. So the power will be, what is the force? 1.5 kilo Newton. Okay, fine. I'm writing the units also into the velocity. How to find the velocity? It's constant velocity is simple. It is the displacement that is 100 meter divided by five seconds. So all the units are in SI, that is Newton, meter and second. So we can just simplify that. This should be that simple, I believe, 20. So it will be 1.5 into 20 into, we can say 1000. And the power answer should be in what? Because we're talking about the power. So on calculating it, it is coming out to be 30 kilowatt. Yeah. So the answer is D from this uh, explanation. Let us uh, verify. Yes, the answer is D. There is nothing different about it. Whatever we have done is absolutely correct. With this, all the best. Bye.